Today I'm showing you a very nice 2016 Thor Outlaw. It is a 29H, a Class C toy hauler, which we don't see too often these days. It's very nice. It has all the features you would expect, and it's very low mileage. I believe it was about 23,000. Now let's take a look at it as we wander around. It does have the power awning. It has an outdoor TV as well. You can see right there. Um, it has all sorts of bells and whistles. It does have a very nice feature. It does have side and rear cameras. As you can see right there. Power mirrors. They recently replaced all the tires all the way around. They, ha they replaced the front tires on the road in uh, 2019, and then the rear tires more recently at, um, at a discount tire locally. Very nice rig here. Go around the front. The engine's clean. It has some of that good old Arizona dust in it, but other than that, the engine looks great. The battery in the engine, the chassis battery, is about two years old. There it is, the Outlaw. This couple bought it about a year or so ago, I believe they said, in uh, Florida, when they lived in Florida for a year. They're more Arizona people. It's very nice, a very nice rig. Uh, one of the other features that I always try to point out, which I think is a very important one, is the topper for the slides. And the, the topper seems to be in really good shape. It has a very large slide that covers um, the couch and part of the kitchen. It's on this side of the floor plan. The floor plan is posted with the photos. It has one air, air conditioner. It has two uh, Max Air type fans. has a standard 4KW generator that you see in the 30 amp service, 6 gallon water heater, outdoor shower, um, it has a second air conditioner that was added, you can see the outside, so the specs will show it has 18.5 BTU. The rooftop air conditioner is a standard 13,500 BTU, and then this one right here uh, looks like it was installed with the unit, cools down the 9-foot garage for uh, sleeping or entertaining. Again, you can see the, the toppers pretty well here. Sometimes people don't pay enough attention to things like the topper because it protects that slide from leaves, damage. The seals around the topper are in good shape. I took a look at those pretty closely. Beautiful day in uh, central Arizona. The other thing that you can notice on the slide, uh, not only is the vent fan coming out closest to us, but you'll notice that on those two windows they're frameless and they're... Um, uh, um, insulated as well so they do come with that nice frameless window here you can see the rear window on this side and and the no frame here we are on the back side of it it does have a uh, backup camera as you can see right there and another nice thing that it has is this um, awning over the rear. And in the photos, we have that demonstrated as well. The, uh, oops, a little bit ba backwards there. The uh, ramp 
comes out and it also will it has uh, steel cables that hold it up and it becomes a uh, patio it has rails that go all the way around it so you have a covered patio in essence on this rig when you have the back open it also has a screen that slides across the back so pop our rv is very fortunate to have this uh, on our listings they have some decals those will come off pretty easily now there are a few damage uh, a few dings and scratches in particular right on this corner you can see see if i can hone in on there right there you can see a little bit if you can see that right on the corner and that's about the only ding or or, or bing or bang that i found on this the other things that i that i was able to see are more the standard Arizona, Florida decal damage. You can see all the crackles on that. And that's about the only other thing that I've seen on it. It does have some wear and tear, but it's in very, very, very good shape. It's, I would say it's standard uh, wear and tear. Now, if we take a look at the awning, this is an electric awning. And I think they may have replaced that not too long ago. It's in very good shape. The photos show it. Uh, fully extended so you'll be able to get a, a better chance to look at that uh, has the Jensen outdoor speakers has a Jensen stereo in the back in the in the garage area all in all um, this is priced under uh, not of not a guides by three four thousand dollars so it's a very good value for a low mileage five-year-old beautiful Thor outlaw 29 H and uh, I, it's been my pleasure to show it to you today. Let's see if I can back out here and we can just take one more look from the side. Thank you for looking.